Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to Crypto VO. Welcome back to the channel. As always, coming at you guys with some of the freshly baked hot content in the crypto world and the blockchain. As always, what we're doing around here is we're exposing, uncovering late hot stuff that you guys got to be checking out. But just keep in mind, guys, this is not financial advice by any means. We're not trying to advise you on your investments and whatnot. Just keep in mind, we're just really there to put it in front of you, let you guys know what's coming out, what you guys got to be checking out for. So if that sounds good to you guys, let's get into the video. Now, before we get in, everything I'm going to be talking about today is going to be linked in the description of the video. If you guys do have any questions or comments, be sure to drop them in the comment section below. And if you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button as well and smash that like button. Also, if you're new hit that bell icon so you're notified every single time we make a new upload now we're going to be talking about olympus game today so olympus game is a strategic 3d tower rush game taking place in the greek mythology era which integrates blockchain technology and nft it's a game with a strategic 3d tower rush and that's going to be taking place in the greek mythology era and all that good stuff it obviously incorporates blockchain technologies and nfts which is what we're all about about. Now at the top we have our tabs that we're used to seeing. Obviously we'd like to hit their white paper and it'll give you the description of the game a bit about it and we're going to see that they have their token as well. Olymp is their token and we could see much more on their white paper. Obviously I always strongly suggest you guys go through it. We're going to see the economy, the tokens, the tokenomics, all that good stuff right there. You guys could also check out the gameplay. Also gives you a good idea of what you could expect once you get started. So be sure to check out their white paper. Obviously you guys would want want to hit join the discord it obviously gives you a good idea of what everyone's saying if you guys have questions you guys can you know interact with them through there but obviously we want to check out the other stuff as well now a bit about the story so you guys could go ahead and watch this youtube video it'll give you guys a good idea of what the story is behind the game and a person like that it's obviously shows that they've put time into this they put effort i don't like those other games as much that there's really no story to it so they say right here discover the story behind the olympus game in this short comic book style video and understand Understand more about the game obviously i always strongly suggest if you guys are actually trying to get involved with the game and make money off of it it generally does give you a good little boost to actually watch these things and understand it as opposed to someone who's just playing just to you know make money uh, exclusively now a bit about gameplay you guys are going to see that they say the olympus game is a one versus one tower rush game you need to destroy your opponent your opponent's columns and temple to win the game while defending yours we could see right here you guys are going to see a couple important things deploy your nft cards on the field and destroy the enemy's towers play against other players from your mobile or your computer which is obviously really big upgrade your cards to get higher in the leader dashboard and choose between the free play or play to earn versions as well obviously the fact that it is available on our mobile devices or your desktops does make it a lot more accessible and obviously with new projects we want accessibility to get traction to get traffic in those projects now it is a play to earn token play to earn by win a game scholarship system or complete quests and then you can trade upgrade cards and exchange as well so there are different ways to make off this game and you guys should definitely be checking out all those different avenues see what works for you see what creates an interest for yourselves as well now we continue scrolling we're going to be seeing a bit about their tokenomics so we're going to see the name of the token which i always like to see the total supply 500 million and then we can see what the allocation is from that 500 million so we're going to say that 20 percent is for the team wallet 10 percent esports rewards five percent advisors liquidity five percent as well the ecosystem 10 percent private sale as well 10 percent launchpad five percent staking rewards 20 percent and gaming issuance is 15 percent now i think that's a pretty healthy distribution of the token allocation you obviously have some for the team, some to keep the project going. And generally when you see that they have a good amount to keep the project going, you can see that obviously it's for the long term. And as someone getting involved with it, we like to see that peace of mind of having it be long term. We could see exactly what we could expect for the vesting and all that good stuff, not short term. You guys are gonna see it long term as well. So it's nice to see that that's available for us. It's not always as easy to find that. And then if we continue scrolling, we're gonna see more about the roadmap, exactly what they're trying to do in 2022 in each quarter. So we're gonna see first quarter of 22, the trailer and gameplay release first characters are revealed second quarter of 22 the private ico 
public ICO, regular AMA, and updates about the project. And obviously, given the fact that it's pretty new, they're going to be coming out with new updates and you guys really want to be on top of that stuff. And what's the best way to keep up with that stuff? Obviously, it's joining their Discord and connecting with them on all their social media platforms if possible. Third quarter of 2022, we're going to see the launch pad and the first NFT sale. So obviously, that's going to be really big. So I might be reviewing this again, just given the fact that it's going to be so big. And we obviously don't want to be missing out on that stuff. And then quarter four of this year, official release of the game, NFT marketplace, and all that good stuff. Then we're going to see more stuff in 2023 but that's yet to come we really just want to be focusing on this stuff at the moment so be sure to really hit join the discord now guys they also have this trailer that's available it's so sick as you guys can see the graphics are crazy and you guys can see exactly what it's about how you do it gives you a good idea of what you're going to be experiencing as someone playing the game i don't know just look at these graphics like it's crazy the imagery is insane and i don't know i just feel like when you see a project like this it obviously hypes you up you can see that you know there's effort put into this it's ambitious it's different and those are all things we like to see in new projects like this i don't know she's pretty bad Look at that, she's wilding out. But obviously at the end of the day, what matters most is getting the return on investments. Now, if we continue scrolling, we're gonna be seeing more about it, who the founders and the advisors are. We're gonna see the first one, co-founder, Mathieu Foyer, video game seller for over six years, LinkedIn profiles, and as well on the internet. Joel De Silva as well, co-founder, crypto investor since 2017. So obviously quite a bit of experience there with for both of them, both the co-founders. And we're gonna see the advisor, Francis Ingrand, a CEO of video game publishing company and a gaming studio. And we can see their LinkedIn profiles and Twitter right there. And you guys are gonna see that they're actually hiring. So obviously if they're hiring, that means they're looking towards the future they're trying to get that growth growing and that's what we like to see with a new project like this we can see exactly who they're backed by as well so you guys could definitely do additional research on that and see exactly what you guys could expect in the long term given the fact that they're backed by certain companies and now if we come all the way to the bottom we're going to see what we expect to see we're going to see their instagram we're going to see their twitter as well and then we're going to see their policy and whatnot we have access to their tabs again all the way at the top again be sure to check out their white paper in detail it'll just give you guys a good idea of what the project is saying what you guys can expect from it going forward and how to get started on all that good stuff now if you guys do have any questions be sure to drop them in the comment section below and as i mentioned a lot of those questions can be answered through them as well if you guys want to and in order to do that you guys obviously have to connect with them on their social media as i mentioned everything about olympus and ego is going to be linked in the description of the video so yeah so be sure to hit those links and as always guys if you guys want to stay in the know you guys are going to have to keep coming back to Cryptovio. I'm out.